Hello Twin Flames, it's Tuesday the 8th of August today. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. It's the Lion's Gate portal today, 8-8, eight, eight, very powerful. So I'm going to bring in the World Animal Dreaming Oracle. They give me fear, so I feel fear has been released today as we move ahead. And the tiger is coming through saying, remember who you are. Be confident in yourself to release fear and any struggle and doubt as these doors and these portals open bringing with them great opportunities and great chances for change. So let's see what we need to know. So thank you, angels. What's the energy around the Divine Feminine today? On the Lion's Gate portal, what's the Divine Feminine needing to know? What's the energy, please, for the Feminine? Here we go. What's the energy around the Divine Masculines today? The energy around the Divine Masculines today? Wow, flying out the deck two cards and the energy around the connection today. The energy around the connection today. Thank you, thank you. Here we go. Okay, so there's another card moving at the back of the deck as well. So I'm going to start with the feminine energy for the Lion's Gate portal. Look at this. We've got the ant. Now, this is really powerful because it's about strength. And I feel that you're being reminded that when you and your twin work as a team, whether that's in the spiritual realm in the 5D or when you're getting on, when there's no ego, when there's no stress or struggle, you are a great team. You can do anything. You are a power couple and that gives you strength. So the strength comes today from remembering that you are one and working together. So working for the connection instead of working against the connection. You know, when we are being nasty towards our twin, blaming them for things, talking bad about them, that doesn't work for the connection. It pushes the connection further away and it creates a divide. So you want to build strength. So instead, look for their strength, look for their power, look for the beauty in them, the good in them, the love in them. Because when you look for those things, it's like seeing those things within yourself because you are one. And also that when you work as a team with others, you gain strength. We are a community here on Guided by Angels. So you may feel stronger because you're here every day receiving the messages or because you can connect with the community and the soul family. You feel understood. So you gain strength from community. You know, ants work with others and that's where they find their power. So this is also reminding you that when you give to others, when you are of service, you gain strength and power and your power comes from within you and above you. Now, the energy around the masculines, first of all, we've got the ostrich, which is grounding. So they're feeling more grounded today, feeling more connected with the earthly life they are living, wanting to bring things into the earthly life they are giving. And bringing. So I feel that they want to give. You know, they are seeing things in a higher way. The ostrich is very tall. So they are beginning to stand tall to fight for this love and stand up for the connection and stand up for what they believe in. And they are also learning how to have compassion, to have compassion for you so that they're able to treat you better, to be able to express themselves better, and also to be able to have compassion for themselves. So they don't keep going over the past and feeling guilty about it and blaming themselves. Instead, they have compassion for where they are and what they need to change. The energy around the journey today, we've got the turkey for shared blessing. You know, the turkey is about Thanksgiving. So I feel as you move towards Thanksgiving, you're going to be able to share blessings. You know, the turkey is also connected with Christmas time. So I'm definitely feeling this as an energy of the lion's gate bringing in the opportunities to allow you to be together to share blessings around the holiday period. So between now and December, great opportunities for some of you to come into union or into communication out of long separation. So definitely a great sign of what's to come and that you are sharing blessings together, wanting the same thing on the right path. And we've got durability with the moose. So this is about the way you continue, the way you persevere, that you don't give up, that you are strong and powerful that you are durable, that you can handle whatever's going on, that you can do this. And we've got the number 44 as well, 444, which is a great sign of angel protection. So this is going to be a very powerful day, a day where you realize that working together with your twin is the best form of action, because that's how you share blessings and carry on. 
And that's when you feel the strongest because you are a power couple in those moments, whether you are together physically or together through energy, through your energetic footprint and your vibration. So remember, keep going, don't give up, trust the love and focus on gratitude to bring the blessings in. So great day for power, working as a team, the masculines grounding themselves to have compassion for themselves and you, to bring in a forgiveness, to wipe the slate clean, to create the opportunities to share these times together in the future. And that's what you need to know. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.